In front of me is a Oppo Reno 12FS and today I will show you how you can hard reset this device through recovery mode. To get started I'm going to quickly mention that doing this kind of reset will also allow you to get rid of a screen lock if you have one set that you don't know. In addition it will most likely also FRP lock your, lock your device uh, and that happens when you have a screen lock along with a Google account signed in on your device and you do this kind of reset. Now what that means is once the reset is finished all you need to do is just verify either the screen lock or the Google account that was previously signed in on a device before the reset and if you can do one of those you're good to go. Now for people that don't know both of those obviously you would be kind of typically, I want to mention that typically, stuck on the setup till you can verify one of those. Now the reason I'm saying typically is because I will be recording as the next video a guide on how you can bypass this and then completely remove it for people that might need it. Now for people that are just want to get rid of a screen lock because maybe your child set one up, uh, we're gonna get started from the screen lock. So as you can see the device is right now locked and all we need to do is hold power button, volume up and then swipe down to turn off your phone. Once the device turns off, hold your power button and volume down at the same time. And after a moment you will feel a vibration and then you'll see the Oppo logo, at which point you can let go of the power button but keep holding volume down. There we go. Next, select your desired language, for me that's going to be English, and then choose Format Data. This in turn generates some random code right here. Every time it's going to be different for you. Obviously, it's going to be showing up a different four digit code. Uh, whatever it shows for you, just type it in. For me, it's 3402. Once you type it in con uh, correctly, it gives you this pop up format data. All user data will be uh, reset. I'm gonna select format. And this begins factory resetting. At this stage it only takes a couple of seconds, so click on OK. And this will now reboot the device and continue the factory resetting of it in the background. This will take about a minute, two minutes to finish up. And once it's completed, we should be presented with Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible for me. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your device however you like. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.